So hi guys, magandang hapon, good afternoon. Um, so later on today guys, I'm going to show you the update of our Kubo. I know I haven't uh, shown it to you guys uh, within the last episodes of my vlog. So they're still working on it. I don't want to, you know, but once they're done this afternoon, I'll show it to you guys. Uh, but for now, let's pick pineapples here so they can eat it. I had one uh, yesterday na, and it was already overripe because we missed it. We didn't see it being um, ripe. So I don't know which one to pick. Oh, they're all so big, guys. I think this is called uh, Hawaiian pineapple. Huge, huge pineapple. But look at this. Some already uh, tipped over. This is big. Let's pick this one. Some are also huge, but this one is still green. And there's one there that's already tipping over. I think most of them has fruits. And also this one is tumba na. Tumba na siya. Maybe it's too heavy. But look how big. But let's pick this one. This one. So, I... Do you have a very sharp leaves, guys. Ooh. Anyways, let's pick this one. This one. Snap it. Just like that. So big. It's huge. <clears throat> uh, by the way, guys, I was told um, that if you want to plant pineapples usually some people keep this one I just call this the crown see this little crown once you cut it that's what the use some people usually plant this one but usually they said that one will take a while to bear fruit so if you want something that will bear fruit sooner you want to plant the one that's um, the stem that's growing around the pineapple just like this this one guys ito yung itatanim nyo so this is the fruit, this is the crown, this is the fruit. So around it, there are small um, branches of pineapple or pineapple plant. That's what you want to plant so that way they will have more fruit sooner. See this one? That's what I'm going to take later on. I'm going to plant this one and there's one more right here. They're not going to bear fruits guys. They're just going to come out like this. So we're going to take it and plant it. That's what my husband and I did with uh, last uh, last year's harvest. Um, <clears throat> we took the one that's coming out on the side and planted there. And one already has fruits at the back. Anyways, let's have my husband cut it up. Ugh. You can have pineapple snack. Pineapple from the farm, guys. Let's go find some knife, guys. Cut this up one time. Very hot, so warm. Mm. It's so good, guys. It's warm from the sun, but it's yummy and sweet. It's so good. Crunchy, it's sweet. It's perfect. I can do it. 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 I 
There's our pet chai. Watering our pet chai. That's the irrigation guys, just here. Chai here, closer to the irrigation. My husband, guys, never stops moving here at the farm. He's always here, he's always doing something. Now he's planting papaya. Yesterday they planted tomatoes, now papaya. <clears throat> Hi, babe. The papaya. <clears throat> Let's get some water, guys, and I'm gonna water um, the papaya that my husband planted. about three over there There's so much things to do here guys at the farm but it's all right we plant it's like um the pineapple we planted the pineapple we ate it at least we know where our food comes from right these ones guys this one i planted myself these three we have more calabasa here guys on this side of the the farm at the end of the farm Look at this. This is our calabasa, our squash. There's so much more. So here at the farm, guys, we already have uh, sitao, long beans. This one, squash, um, pepino, cucumber. We have. Um, pet chai and we have uh, eggplant that's seedling and we also have uh, more tomatoes so maybe in a few months we'll have plenty of food to eat especially now that Jill has um, 10 babies and I hope they do well you know hopefully by then by the time they're ready to eat we have enough food uh, for them and also for us so let's cross our fingers guys Anyways guys, I will show you the update of the farm to see what's been done. So let's take a look. So here it is guys. Have a look. Let's start with the outside first. <laughs> so the railing is up as you can see. It's all the way around. See, it's already up all the way. So this is the tiles guys this is almost the last part that they have to do in the sink so this is what it looks like here so i don't want to step on them they're working on that today and this is the inside this one was done since last week the sink they still have to do and the bathroom all tiles it's all done they just have to install the toilet and here it is guys and some of the windows guys has been installed last week this one okay, this one is installed this is sliding here and this one is installed and also the corner here In the bathroom sorry I didn't show you the bathroom is done so what needs to be done here is just the door the shower door and the door here in the bathroom so this tells guys hopefully it's um, 
it's done by tomorrow and all the finishing uh, concrete finishing is all done all finished today the last part was at the front oh sorry the last part was this one so this is done and also everything here is done even the outer part it's done and i'll show you the railing guys of our steps of our uh, stairs going up so this is it so this is the railing this side here and the last part they have to do is the steps so we're gonna go up guys we just have to be careful because the not all of the flooring upstairs it's almost done but it's still wet because they're working on it today so we just gotta go up and be careful anyways Kailangan natin magdahan-dahan sa agdanan kasi hindi pa siya nakaano. Hindi pa siya ayos. It's not fixed yet, the stairs. And there are big gaps. Look. But, the stairs, guys. Going up. And also, the railing here is done. This part here. That's done. And all this here is for me to step on. So here's the tiles, guys. Upstairs tiles. Here. And here is the view from the top. The balcony is here. So it's already like 5.30. So they're just resting now. And I wanted, my first plan guys was to have the same tiles and our bedroom goes out in the balcony, but we did not have enough tiles, this tile. So as I said, what we're gonna do is use this one. These, we're gonna use it on the, what do you call that? On the sink instead and this tile we bought yesterday or oh, the other day the other day which is fine so it's okay and also i think you've seen this one the ceiling is done this one is done a while back and we also have windows here guys excuse the sampai sampai these are the worker stuff but yeah so this one is installed um i think tuesday last week they're pretty quick the only thing that they didn't do yet because they had to wait until the tiles is done is this side window here this is the ceiling to floor window this one so they had to wait till the tiles is here so this you're gonna come tomorrow and measure it and also the, the windows here and the sliding here in that one so those are the only ones once that's installed we are ready to move in that's all we're waiting on now is those things plus that the little bit of touches and let's look at the bathroom guys this one is already tiled it's done uh, let's see and they also installed the window this one is just the flooring that I want. The rest I wanted to keep it just like this. Because it's gonna be closet anyways. And also some of the lights is installed. So at night guys, last night this one was lit. It was so bright here. Um, it was nice. So the workers can come and chill. It's a lot brighter. So they already installed the lights. This is what it looks like here. This little square. There's some there, there. I'm not sure. I think we have to put one more. And here, I didn't buy anything yet. That's something that I will purchase down the road. And even here, they already installed the lights. I don't know. So, we're almost there, guys. Um, today is already Tuesday. I spoke with a 
foreman he said maybe Friday or Saturday and they should be done the little touches the painting my husband will do and same as the railing I think my husband will take care of that so just just the majority they need to do but my god look at the view of this mountain guys it's so clear no clouds nothing right there guys this is the Isarog this is the best view of all um, there's a lot of work to do here at the farm there's always things to do you never run out my husband he never stops moving once he's here he just all over the place you know um, because I can't do it most of the time because I have Balin so he takes care of uh, most of the work farm work but once you move in I will I want my I want my time my farm time because every time I'm here working it's um, it's a lot of work but for me it's a stress reliever you know it's, it's something different I'm not sure if you would understand but to me um, I love it I love getting my hands dirty you know it's just a stress reliever maybe in the morning that's my time for myself I usually wake up early anyway so maybe I'll have maybe 5 30 to I don't know 8 o'clock farm time for me and the rest my husband can have <laughs> But yeah guys, I can't wait for Balin and Aggie to live here. You know, this is something that we've been wanting to do for so long. Um, we didn't know if it was right for us to do it. Uh, move here in the Philippines and live here. But it's been a year. It's been a blessful, blessful year. We, we've learned a lot and you know, there's, there's no regret whatsoever. Up to today, there's nothing, nothing. So yeah guys so i hope you guys are enjoying my vlog um so today guys i've reached uh, 6k so thank you kindly it's 6k subscribers so thank you so much guys that's a lot uh, just a lot for me even getting 100 was already a lot for me <laughs> at the beginning so thank you again guys maraming maraming salamat ulit and i can't wait for you guys to enjoy it even just on my vlog you know uh, I'm glad I'm able to share my my life here in the Philippines because this is a journey. So I can never come back to this moment, guys. So I'm glad I'm able to share this with you. I'm able to document this uh, this life that I have here in the Philippines. I mean, it's not about bragging. Look at me, look at me, look at my life now. It's about being able for you guys to enjoy and hopefully um, give you an idea if this is something that you want to do in the future with your family na lumipat dito sa Pilipinas at tumira. So I'm just glad I'm able to do this uh, vlog, guys. I, I do enjoy editing. Um, at the beginning, it was my husband that would edit, but I fired him. He's just two critics, you know. He has a lot of blah, 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 blah. <laughs> so I'm like, no, teach me how to edit and I'll do it myself. So I've been editing. I've been doing it myself. I'm trying to be creative as much as I can. So just bear with me, guys. But yeah, so I am glad some of you are enjoying it. I've been getting a lot of comments on um, YouTube, so thank you kindly, guys. Uh, a lot of good feedback, so I appreciate that. Even negative feedbacks, throw it in. I don't mind, you know. If you have something to say or if you have any suggestions to me, why not? Right? I'm open. I'm open. Like, I have no problem. But anyways, guys, this is our... Um, our home right now our kubo i'm always gonna call this kubo guys because i'm so used to it if you've been following my blog you have seen our kubo and even valen every time you see the roof he says oh mom that's my kubo that's baby's kubo that's what he calls it so this is gonna be our kubo guys so yeah Ito na, malapit na. he said uh maybe four days five days max and then we're done so hopefully by then the, and the the installation of the windows is done because we can't move in here without those because those are very important we have a baby the baby Valen and Agi anyways guys maraming maraming salamat ulit that's my vlog for today um, I'm gonna try to put out as much vlog as I can I'm gonna try to do maybe daily in the future as much as I can I think it will help me a lot especially when it comes to editing you have no idea how long it takes me <laughs> to edit one video 
a lot of time and especially another issue with that guys is the the internet here in the philippines is not very reliable sometimes i would have to upload my video it can take like six hours or longer sometimes an hour an hour and a half that would be my lucky time but sometimes six hours or more just to upload one video because the internet is so slow so i don't know maybe doing a daily vlog would help me especially when it comes to editing but yeah anyways guys maraming maraming salamat ulit thank you all for watching this is the end of my vlog see you guys next time bye salamat ulit.